The Declaration of Independence. We hold these truths to be self-evident. That all men are created equal. That they are endowed by their creator with certain and alienable rights. That I'm uh, that I'm these uh, life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. That to secure these rights, governments are instituted among people. Deriving their just powers from the consent of the government. The government becomes disruptive of these acts. <coughs> it is the right of people to alter it to abolish it. And to institute a new government. We are therefore for the representatives of the United States of America. The General Communist Assembly. Applying to the Supreme Judge of the World. By the authority of the good people of these colonies. Declare that these United Colonies are free and independent states. That they are resolved from all regions of the British Crown. And that all political connections between them and the state of Great Britain. Is and ought to be totally dissolved. And that is free as independent states. And for the support of this declaration. And with the firm reliance of the protection of the divine providence. We mutually pledge to each other our lives, our fortunes, and our sacred honor.
While I can never forget what they did here, it is rather for us a living to be dedicated to the great task remaining before us. That we high our resolve, these dead shall not have died in vain. That the nation shall have a new birth of freedom. It is a dream deeply rooted in the American dream. I have a dream that one day this nation will rise up and live out the true meaning of its creed. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. I have a dream that my four little children will one day live in a nation where they'll not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. I have a dream today. I have a dream that one every valley shall be exalted. For every hill and mount shall be made low. And the crooked place will be made straight. And all glory shall be revealed and all flesh shall see it together. With this faith we will be able to hew out the mountains of despair and a new stone of hope. With this faith we will be able to transform the jangling discourse of our nation into a beautiful symphony of brotherhood. With this faith we will be able to work together, to pray together, to struggle together, to go to jail together, to stand up for freedom together. This will be the day when all of God's children will sing with new meaning.
I hear America singing by Walt Whitman. I hear America singing the varied carols I hear. Those are my chanting each one singing his as it should be blithe and strong. The carpenter sang as he measured his prank or beat. The mason singing his as he makes ready for work or leaves off work. The boat man singing with bones to head was but the deck hand singing on the steamboat deck. The shoemaker sings as he sits on the spits. The hatter sings as he stands. The wood chopper song the plow boy. On his way in the morning or at noon intermission or at sundown. The delicious sing of the mother. Or of the work of the mother. Or of the girls sewing or washing. Which singing it belongs to him or her? The day what belongs to the day. A night to young folks. Robotic friendly. Singing with open mouths. Their strong melodious songs. I hear American singing.